Greetings to all lovers of exciting adventures and solving mysteries. In this video, we will dive into the world of exciting quests and puzzle games that will make us think and apply logic. If you like to develop your mind, have fun solving challenging puzzles, and explore new worlds, then this video is for you. This is B Indie. thanks for the like, and enjoy watching. I know this place. This is an experimental first-person mystery quest game, game developers from the CIS. Its unusualness is that they do not know how the plot will develop. The plot of each chapter depends on the vote of the players after passing the previous chapters. The developers only give ties and make the basis for the plot. Each player will understand what is happening in their own way. The plot of the game will raise many interesting questions. The quest is shrouded in the atmosphere of old courtyards and apartments of Eastern Europe. Lots of references and Easter eggs in every chapter. The game was developed on Unreal Engine and translated into two languages, English and Russian, along with voice acting. The main character is a man, a man. The player does not know his name or his past. The introductory video tells only that the hero received a letter from an old friend, Vladimir, who says that he does not have much time and invites him to visit the place of his childhood. From the main trailer of the project, we can also understand that this is most likely the place of the hero's childhood where he has not been for many years and where much has changed for some reason. Our hero goes there without hesitation in his old Moskvich car. The hero arrives in a typical courtyard. It looks like it's from the 80s and 90s. The game itself begins in a locked apartment on the first floor of an ordinary apartment building, which still stands in Eastern Europe. Our hero calls Volodya to meet him, but there is no one in the apartment, only silence, the sound of a light autumn wind outside the window, and dripping water in the old sink in the kitchen. Our hero wants to lie down to rest after a long journey. We enter the hall. Everything seems to be normal, but no. Because the TV is sealed with newspapers, there is a huge hatch or porthole on the ceiling. Lots of questions, but we want to sleep for now. We fall into a dream, a strange dream. The hero dreams of some old electrical appliances and a scientist in a dressing gown. Someone is developing something around the laboratory. But the dream is interrupted by the conversation of neighbors. The hero will try to get out of the apartment at home and along the way look for a friend, to whom in fact he came. But it will not be so easy, and he will have to go through more than one apartment. Moreover, each apartment is like a separate stage of the story, with its own riddles, characters, and quests. Different floors, apartments, and rooms of a house can represent a completely different kind of space. The main idea of the project is that the players do not know and will not learn in detail from the history what exactly is happening here. Each player himself will understand what is happening and after passing each chapter will be able to vote so that he would like to see further as he understands what is happening. The developers will have players fill out a simple form at the end of the game. By analyzing the data of the players, they will be able to build the plot of subsequent chapters. Not all players will be able to access the influence on the plot of the chapters. It depends on the conditions, number of tokens the player has. Players can also receive real prizes in the form of real items from the game if they can solve additional puzzles and find easter eggs. An important point, the plot of the game will constantly change in the course of the release of new chapters. The DAO concept will be used here. For the first chapter, everyone who bought it will be able to vote and leave their proposal in a special form. The developers will take this into account when creating Chapter 2, and those who want to create their own voting, propose riddles and items to the game and leave their own larger footprint in the game. DAO and token voting on the Snapshot platform will be interesting. With every minute in I Know This Place, more and more strange, things begin to happen. The first-person game will completely immerse you in the atmosphere of Eastern Europe at the end of the last century and may bring back nostalgic memories for some. The game was released recently, it cost $7.99. On the threshold of distant 1989, the protagonist of the Firewatch game, a man named Henry, has been living in a boring and dreary suburb for many years. He is tired of the monotonous life and the bustle of the city. He dreams of silence, tranquility and solitude with wildlife. He succeeds in achieving what he wants, and he sets off as a guardian of environmental safety in the dense forest of Wyoming. There, on top of the highest mountain, he will take the post of forester and will watch over the wild savanna. He will maintain contact with the outside world through his boss Delayla, communicating with her using a walkie-talkie. 
This summer turned out to be very hot and dry, damaging nature. Henry needs to carefully monitor what is happening in order to avoid forest fires. He likes his new life and is quite satisfied. In the early morning he enjoys picturesque landscapes, fresh air and forest walks. But one day in the distance, he notices a strange phenomenon. This forces him to leave his post and go to inspect the territory. Together with the hero, you have to explore the area in detail and understand what disturbed the peace of the dense forest. Who is hiding in the dark thicket and whether nature is in danger, you need to find out. The game costs $19.99 and has earned tilde $21 million. Escape Simulator is a first-person cooperative puzzle game. The gameplay is a quest room in which you need to solve all the puzzles and successfully leave the room. Quests, tasks and item locations are randomly generated, which increases the replay value of the project. The environment is fully interactive. You can interact with any objects by picking them up and rotating them in any plane. You can inspect objects, move furniture, break, destroy fragile vases, and much more. There are a total of 20 unique rooms to explore in Escape Simulator. They are filled with exciting puzzles that make you puzzle over the solution. Some are nailed to the wall or hidden behind some object, allows you to play alone or cooperate with a friend to solve puzzles together. Players will have to read books, diaries, notes, study ancient artifacts and look for the answer to the question in every possible way. There is an unusual hint system. As a bonus, an extensive level editor is presented, allowing you to create your own quest room, filling it with various tasks and puzzles. Prove yourself as a real constructor and share your work with your friends to challenge their logic. The game costs $14.99 and has earned tilde dollar two, seven million. Escape the Backrooms is an action-adventure horror game based on the phenomenally successful internet phenomenon of the so-called behind-the-scenes. Walk through deserted locations and find a way out of intricate labyrinths that seem endlessly long. Solve the puzzles you encounter and be careful, because frightening creatures roam nearby and you never know what awaits you around the next corner. The idea is based on a popular creepypasta about an empty office space with muted yellow walls, wet carpet, and buzzing fluorescent lights. Internet users have come up with many other places, united by abandoned themes and the lack of exit in the form of windows or doors. The developers skillfully embodied that very dull atmosphere of loneliness and loss, so fans of the internet legend will highly appreciate the project. The gameplay is designed both for a single passage and for a cooperative group of up to four players. The game has a contactless voice chat for easy communication, but be careful, because the monsters may well hear you from the next room and run to the call. Try to hide behind rare objects or rely on the speed of your run, wobbling between partitions. Solve challenging puzzles to open your way to the next area. Collect missing items and solve puzzles with the whole team. Gradually, their complexity increases but do not worry, because along with this, hints appear. Carefully inspect walls, ceilings and floors for signs or notes with a code. The game costs $9.99 and has earned tilde dollar two, seven million. The House of Da Vinci 3 is an exciting sequel to the adventure game franchise with out-of-the-box puzzles. Step into Renaissance Italy and step into the shoes of Giacomo. You are not just a student, but a devoted friend of the legendary Leonardo da Vinci, and from now on, you are trying to solve the secrets of the great master left as a legacy. Immerse yourself in the abyss of secrets and find out what the high Italian society really is and what place you occupy in all this chaos. Travel not only through the narrow streets of Florence, but also jump in time to find out all the plans of the mysterious order. The project completes the trilogy of the same name, in honor of which the developers have prepared a surprise for the players in the form of an exciting story with an unexpected denouement and a large number of mysteries. The House of Da Vinci 3 is distinguished by a more elaborate graphic component, which allows you to fully experience the mystical atmosphere that has developed in a city filled with secrets and intuitive controls will allow you to enjoy the gameplay to the fullest. The gameplay, though similar to the previous parts, but the basic mechanics has undergone significant changes. Be aware of the power contained in the Oculus Perpetua, for it grants the ability to travel through time, travel back in time to solve mysteries in the present, as well as connect with current events. Explore the proposed locations in an attempt to find the necessary items, and then find a use for them. Carefully study the things stored in the inventory, combine them with each other to create new tools or obtain additional information that will give a hint on its use. 
the game cost $19.99 and has earned $130,000. Quern Undying Thoughts is a first-person adventure game with puzzle elements, which is the debut work of the independent studio Zadbox Entertainment. An adventure game where all the action will take place from a first-person perspective, which will allow you to plunge deeper into everything that happens. In a strange way, our main character finds himself in an incredible and mysterious world that will reveal all the secrets for you as you explore it. On your way, you will constantly meet tasks and puzzles of varying degrees of complexity, so you need to connect all the brain activity and also do not forget about ingenuity. Gradually, the more puzzles you solve, the more you will reveal secrets and mysteries covered with a gloomy veil. And this, in turn, suggests that in the end, you will create a whole extraordinary story piece by piece. The gameplay uses a large number of attractive puzzles. Wherever we go, they will meet everywhere. Either some mechanism does not work, then you cannot open the door, or you need to put the object in another place, etc. Fortunately, the tasks here are extremely logical and will not make you lose a lot of time when completing. However, you should look for clues hidden in the notes or in the surrounding objects, as nothing is accidentally placed in the game world. The campaign is built in such a way that the player understands that the game is relatively linear, but the creators still endowed the process with a certain freedom. There are always a few puzzles that unlock new areas of the island or room, where of course the next puzzles are waiting for us. However, you never know for sure what to do in specific situations. We will not see an extensive introductory video in the game that will explain the general assumptions of the scenario. Instead, we will immediately land on a mysterious island, and individual threads of a not-so-interesting story will be revealed by reading a letter left by a man named William, the only person we will hear during the game. It is also worth noting that the main character is completely mute, and the authors did not give him any name. Some see this as an advantage because it will allow them to better empathize with the main character. The game costs $24.99 and has earned tilde $1, 4 million. Riven. The sequel to Myst is the sequel to the acclaimed Myst game. The sequel was developed over four years and was released in 1997. If the original game took up space on one CD, then the second part took five times as much. The project turned out to be very large scale, but sales, although they were expectedly large, were inferior to the Myst of 1993, 1.5 million versus 12 million respectively. Despite the fact that the game is called differently than the first part, it is a direct continuation of it, expanding the game world, bringing many new details to it. Based on the intention of the creators, the project was created for two types of players at once. For directly hardcore gamers who were offered severe tests in the form of even more difficult puzzles, in comparison with the first game, and for the second, the so-called tourists, the game provided amazing species, by the standards of 1997. The plot of the game tells about the same wanderer between the worlds and the actions of the second part follow the ending of the first. There is an abyss between them, but it is described in a novel based on the 1995 game. The gaming setting has unfolded far beyond computer entertainment, but all directions are official and influence each other. From a technical point of view, we still have the same quest with a first-person view in the virtual world, reminiscent of the real world in its views. By the standards of the games of those years, in Riven, the sequel to Myst, visualization was at unthinkable heights. As for the gameplay, a large number of puzzles are now diluted with a vast world, suitable for leisurely and thoughtful study. The game costs $5.99 and has earned $120,000. Waking up in We Were Here Forever in the Dangerous Castle Rock, the hero must figure out how to get out of a sinister place from which there is no way out. In a puzzle adventure game, the protagonist and a friend will have to face dangerous dark forces to get out of the trap, or they will stay here forever. The game has a cooperative, which is designed for two players, where each puzzle must be solved jointly, performing separate roles, communicating through walkie-talkies, and trying to convey all sorts of information about what they saw and heard to their partner. Indie Horror belongs to a series of games of the same name, but acts as a standalone adventure with a separate plot and story. The main character, along with a friend, finds himself in a kind of trap in Castle Rock, from which there is no way out. The guys realize that they have been deceived, 
and it is necessary to join forces to explore a vast territory together and solve puzzles acting in the distant Antarctic. Here you have to beware of everything that is hidden in the shadows and also you cannot trust everything that you can see. Comrades must act one at a time, communicating by radio, trying to explain what they saw to their partner in case of danger in order to quickly solve a logical problem. Soon, players are faced with ancient forces that are particularly cruel and vicious and are able to destroy them. The walls of the castle are inhabited by a lot of entities that you should be aware of. For example, the Jester, he is really the most powerful creature. The game costs $17.99 and has earned tilde dollar two, eight million. Escape First Alchemist is an exciting adventure game with many challenging puzzles and co-op support. Act as a student of the outstanding alchemist Trimagistus, who, despite all his intelligence, often amazes others with crazy ideas. So this time you have to face his raging genius, because as a task for his students, the wizard placed himself in a trap from which he was unable to get out. So that you would surely save him and not leave him to the mercy of fate, he also locked you in his halls. It seems that there is no escape from fate, especially if this phrase refers to the riddles of Trimagistus. The developers worked hard on the puzzles to make them as diverse as possible and not let you get bored in the process of passing. Luckily, they did an excellent job of it and some of the puzzles will really make you break your head. Explore detailed locations and interact with a variety of objects. It is worth noting that when creating maps, the developers were inspired by real sketches of the alchemists' shelters of that time, which made it possible to create a magical atmosphere. Rotate the found things, combine them with each other, and don't forget about the cauldron with potions. Look for recipes and create decoctions that will allow you to quickly cope with some cases. The game was recently released, cost $14.99, and earned $47,000. Moncage is a puzzle game that is unique in its essence, in which you will explore the surrounding world and locations through a special cube, on the sides of which different parts of the picture are depicted. As such, the game has no plot. It is only known that players are invited to explore an abandoned factory, which is located on a very unusual island, and it can only be explored through a special, unusual cube. Separate fragments of the island and the same factory are located on the walls of this cube, and each of these fragments is connected with the neighboring fragment, with what is located on the neighboring side. Moreover, a fragment of the side wall can be connected, for example, with another side wall of the cube, and with its top. The bottom line is this. Looking at the pictures, you should find halves of something in common on them. It can be a bicycle wheel, half of which is in different pictures, or part of an electrical wire, or even something small and insignificant. After finding two parts of such an item, you can combine them, which will allow you to start the process of interacting with this item. Well, then anything can happen. The most notable thing is that by finding such fragments and discovering fragments that depend on each other, you will gradually reveal the storyline of the game. In the end, you will definitely discover something interesting for yourself. But first, you have to solve several dozens of the same type, but very different puzzles. And you will surely enjoy the atmosphere in which all this takes place, the developers have successfully chosen both the voice acting and the musical accompaniment and the background and in general everything that is present in the game. The game costs $14.99 and has earned tilde dollar one, two million. Thanks to Stepan for supporting this release. Here is such a selection turned out. I hope you have found something interesting for yourself. Be sure to write in the comments. Perhaps you have learned some kind of game and what project you would add to this list.